Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in subsistence. Yes, we are back. We are doing things like looking at that wolf over there in the creek, river, whatever you want to call it. Now we're doing other things like running back and forth and not being sure of ourselves now. Just fine. We know what we're up to. We know. We know. We're going to come over here and we're going to put down a set of stairs. Okay, let's see. Got that. Give me this. Yay! Now we have another entry point to our base. I kind of want to put another set of stairs right there just so I don't have to jump every time. Eh, we're making cordage though. Hold on, let's see. I want to make a half wall and then I want to make two doorways. And we'll start with that, and then we will go from there. Let's see. I guess while we're waiting on all that stuff to craft, I should be collecting wood or, you know, doing something useful. I think that's normally how things go. trying to think of what we should do today other than the normal I don't know if we should work oh I know what we need to do we need to check out what we need for our weapon upgrades and start focusing on that that's what we need to do because I think I got the wall for the most part situated I know I know it's not completed but I think it's situated to where it will it will help out tremendously like yeah, I'm, I'm confident in what we have for right now to help us out greatly during hunter attacks. I don't know if I'll ever completely go around the base with it or not. It just depends. I kind of like it when the hunters get in the water and I shoot them. It's like shooting a fish in a barrel. It's kind of cool kind of like it. Let's see. Okay, so we're almost there. Alright, so the first thing will be the half wall. Okay. I can deal with the half wall. I'm hoping that these half walls work. Because I don't want to do full walls because I really, I like to be able to see out. If I wanted to be, you know, like fortress style, I'd build a big, huge, you know, fortress and make it to where you couldn't see out. But, you know, I like to be able to see over the walls and out and about and all that. 
I just want to make it to where the hunters are like, hey, look at me, I'm a hunter, I can't shoot you because your wall is just slightly taller than, than me. Yep, that is what I'm going for, slightly taller than the hunter. Well, I don't even want it slightly taller than Hunter. Really, I just want their heads to stick out so that I can pop them. Just want to pop them in the head. I don't know if I really need to mess with doors on this or not, though. I mean... I don't know. Part of me says I don't need to. That's what part of me says. I think I'm going to go ahead and make stairs. That way we don't have to jump when we come running up to these. Because that's really annoying. Like, look, I can't run. I have to jump. Okay. Got a stair. And there we go. Now we can run straight up here. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. get one more for right here and we should be good yep okay so I'll put a stair there and I think for the most part we're good on that aspect so I mean I'm still gonna add to the wall as time goes on but I don't think I need to focus on the wall anymore. I think I can now back off of it and try to focus more on the weapons. Weapons and armor. Nice. Alright, let's go check out weapons and armor. Let's see, here's the shotgun. Go ahead and put that shell away. Okay, so we are going to need a bunch of ingots. Like nine rope. Okay, so I think we're going to have to start focusing on sinew. Uh, hold on, let me put the shotgun back. Let me see here, rope. Okay, that's nine right there. And that's going to leave us with seven sinew left. So yeah, we're going to have to go hunting. We're going to have to kill... Kill some, uh... Kill some kitties. We're going to have to kill the kitty. Do I do it today, though? Hmm. Probably not. I don't know. I could kill the kitty with the magnum, but I don't want to. I don't know. We still got a lock pick. We could always look for a locked box. That might be a decent thing to do today. Try to find that locked box. while our uh, while the rope is crafting because if I die and I lose two or three ropes oh ho, 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 I am gonna be upset yep I will most definitely be upset I'll be like really really game like you just did that to me like after all the times that I've played and argued and spent time with. Yeah, but that's how you're going to do me. And it will. The game will be like, yeah, I did that. What you going to do? Hey, locked box. Awesome. Got some cotton seeds. That's good. A little bit of iron got some sinew 
Not a bad box. Not a bad box. So at least that will increase my sinew by a little bit. I mean, not a lot, but, you know. So I'm thinking we focus first on the shotgun upgrade, because if I can get that, then we'll have at least one really powerful weapon that we can use up close. And then I think after that, a magnum upgrade would be nice. And then possibly a rifle upgrade if we decide to do one. Let's see, you know what? I'm gonna put the rope over here. Because I need it for you. Okay, that's not too bad. Starting to get a little bit of metal gathered up here. How many... Is that nine ingots? That is nine ingots. Hold up. We don't have enough to do this today, do we? Oh, all we need is the mass. Um, turn you on. We might begin our shotgun upgrade today. I'm going to toss you off in there and turn you on. Pull those out. Starting to get a little bit full anyway. Alright, let's see. While that's running, let's go ahead and hop out here and... Seed. That will give us six seeds. So we only need one more cotton seed. and Well, no, two more. And we'll have a full um, a full box, full plant bed to uh, grow off of. I forgot to put the tomato seeds out there. How many tomato seeds do we have out here now? Oh, we have enough to do a whole box. Awesome. That is what I like to hear and see and have and all kinds of stuff. How are the chickens doing? Yeah, they're not too bad. Not too bad at all. While we're running things, let me come up and check the bed spawns. We have 13. That's not too bad. Hundred and twenty-four. Mm. <sighs> the question is, is do I drop drop some of this wood down in there? You know what? I'm going to go ahead and drop a stack of 50 just because. Just because we're going to go ahead and boost that up a little bit. Yeah, we'll let that run now. We'll just let it run. Okay, so we're going to get the shotgun upgrade, which is going to be awesome. It's going to be like, well... It's not going to be the ultimate weapon, but it's going to it's going to pack a punch. I mean, a 20% upgrade on its power. Yeah. It'll have a nice little kick to it. I think it's a 20% upgrade. 
I think each level of firepower goes up by 20%. I think. If I remember correctly. I do need that. Yeah, okay. So I need electronics. Yeah. Because, you know, you got to have electronics to upgrade the power of a shotgun. That makes complete, total sense. I mean, why not? I'm being impatient. Two oh eight. So close. Yay. Upgrade. Turn off. We're gonna have a shoddy. We're gonna have a shoddy. It's gonna be a super awesome shoddy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see, it says plus 60% firepower there. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That's... Whenever we turn the hunters back on, that's gonna... That's gonna level the playing field a little bit better. Let's see what it's gonna take here. I actually have enough of this. I need three rope to do another one. Do I have enough for three rope? I don't know. We might just go ahead and do the... Yep. Alright, looks like we're going to try to upgrade our magnum as well. I guess while we're waiting on it, I'm going to go collect some wood. to make ourselves useful so now we are going to be down well we are down a lot of sinew and I do need the sinew to make the combat armor and the headgear the right helmet so that is a problem but I do think that we can fix that um, If I have to, I'll take the shotgun out and we'll wreck some kitties. And we'll go from there. I mean, you know, we'll start killing cats, getting the sinew, and just, you know, building up. I am feeling good about today's, uh, today's progress. We have done a lot. That shotgun upgrade was a big one. Um, the next shotgun upgrade is going to cost a lot. I think, I think last season we did it, and then we, then we had the the death from the kitty shortly thereafter, where our bag rolled through the rock, and we lost it. And yeah. I remember that now. That was that was a bad deal. We lost our brand new level four powered shotgun. Yeah. But I did get to wreck a bunch of hunters with it beforehand, so it wasn't a total loss. I have seen the power a level four firepower shotgun will do. So I do want to upgrade the firepower on the shotgun to four. I want to just keep upgrading it, honestly. I want to get... Uh, I don't know if I want to do clip size or if I want to do reload speed first, because... Uh, I just don't know. I mean, part of me says, you know, the more, the more rounds I can shoot at one time, the better, because that's faster than reloading is just to have another round in the chamber but if you reload faster then you get like double the rounds you'd normally have so mm, I don't know 
That will be something that we will think about and talk about later. That will be after the Magnum update. Or upgrade. Because, yeah, we're getting the Magnum firepower upgrade at least one time. That way it can have its extra 20% as well. Since we're kind of using it for a lot of different things right now. Because that's really, really all we have ammo for. So maybe it'll help save on some bullets and I'll use 20% less rounds or I'll stretch it out 20% further or something. We're getting a good amount here. Oop, or... Not iron, but I will take it. I'd really like to find two or three iron nodes real quick. That would be nice. That would most definitely be nice. Alright, let's go see where we're at with everything. We just need a little bit of mass. Kind of like that much. Oh yeah, upgrading the firepower. It is a good day to have some weapons. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we have a level 1 firepower on the gun. On the magnet. Which is awesome. Can't lie. Can't deny. We've got the good stuff going on it. Let's go ahead and add that. That way we can just work all of that out. We'll take those. See, we have way too much. You know, I'm going to take some of this out. You know... Okay, I'm just... I'm going to make a new chest. I'm going to make a new chest. How many does it take? Four? It takes five. Okay, we're going to make a new chest. Put it over here. That way I can put all of my raw ore in it. Because, yeah... Just the zinc alone is starting to pile up tremendously, and uh, it'll be one step closer to getting all of our stuff done. You know, I wanted to look here real quick while we're waiting. Okay, so we can do clip size. Ah, so all the level 1 upgrades are pretty much the same. They don't... I was hoping that they weren't going to be like... You know, if I did three levels of firepower, that this was going to be the same as this for the first one. So that's cool. So it might actually be... To my advantage... To go ahead and do one or two of these before doing that last firepower upgrade. Maybe. Just maybe. Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to have to think about that. Because it's one of those deals. I've never done any of these. So I don't know how... How like... How much faster the reload speed is. You know, is it... 5%? Is it 10%? Is it 20%? You know, how much faster is that reload speed if I get it? Okay, go ahead and get all that in there. And my copper and my iron. There's some 
more copper here. I'm just gonna put that down there. All right, so we have a ton of zinc, a good amount of copper, a little bit of iron, and I don't know if I wanna put this all in there or not. Technically, it is an ore. We are refining it. Let's put it at the bottom. And we have a ton of potassium. So, that's good. We can use that to make... Uh, what's it called? Um, Gunpowder. Just do a little quick organizing real fast. There we go. Go ahead and bring those down. And it's kind of it's kind of organize this just a little bit here so we can kind of see what we got going. Okay, that would be for like windows. Oh, we got extra stuff, huh? I guess we can do that. Maybe. Take this over here. Refill you. And then put you in there. Yeah, that's a little bit better. I'm not going to say it's perfect by any means, but that's a little bit better. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm digging that. All right, let's get the shotgun out of here. Put you back in there. All right. So, we got, we got some stuff going today. We really got some stuff going today. I am happy with the progress we made. Uh, need to get more need to get more nails need to get more nails because I'm going to I'm going to be equipped I'm going to be ready they're not catching me off guard like they did last time last time we we're like oh no it's okay if we have you know just a few nails we don't need a wall and this and that yeah we needed a wall that was my bad that was my bad. But anyway, so we got the shotgun upgrade. We got the magnum upgrade. So our weapons are good. Uh, I need to work on getting clothes. I need to get... I need to get cloth. Cloth and sinew are now my two biggest things to get. So once I get... I'm going to get the combat helmet and then the vest... And then I'm going to turn around and I'm going to start trying to work towards the heavy pants and the heavy shirt. And yeah, we'll go from there. So anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, guys, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It's an awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video and to the game itself guys and as always feel free to share the video on any social media you're using and guys just like to stop take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful awesome support all the comments all the likes all the subscribers and all the videos shared guys it is awesome i do appreciate it and with that being said until next time survivors keep on surviving